With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is, a dynamometer D is attached to two blocks of masses 6 kg and 4 kg as shown the reading of the dynamometer is. So dynamometer is simply a let's say spring here attached. So we need to find the spring force. So if we consider this 6 kg and 4 kg as a whole to be a system, so we can say here net mass of this system is 10 kg considering mass of dynamometer to be negligible. So we can say here 30 Newton acting to the right side, 50 Newton acting to the left side, hence net force is towards the left side. So acceleration is to the left, hence pseudo will act towards the right that is of 10 A. So balancing force, this comes as 50 is equal to 30 plus 10 A. Hence we can say 10 A comes as 50 minus 30 which is 20. So A is equal to we can say here as 2 meter per second square. Now if we draw FVD for 6 kg and 4 kg and draw all the forces acting on it. So this here is 50 Newton acceleration is to the left of magnitude 2 as well as for this also acceleration is to the left of magnitude 2 here there is 30 newton pseudo force on 6 kg block here will act to the right words with magnitude 6 into 2 as 12 and here pseudo force on this 4 kg block will act towards right words which is equal to 4 into 2 as 8 hence we can say here the spring force which is the reading of the dynamometer will be acting as shown. So if we calculate spring force from here, this is equal to 50 equal to 2F plus spring force. Hence the value of spring force comes as 38 Newton, which is the reading of the dynamometer as well as from this also, this comes as spring force equal to 30 plus 8. Hence spring force comes as 38 Newton. So 38 Newton means option number we can say 3 is the correct answer. Hence 3 is our answer. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.